Hi, my name is Spencer. I'm at Prime Motor Cars Mercedes-Benz in Scarborough, Maine. To my right is the new 2021 Mercedes-Benz S-Class. This is an S580, the completely redesigned flagship model from Mercedes-Benz. Um, a lot of exciting new stuff in this model. Let's take a closer look. We'll loop around the outside and then the uh, inside of the vehicle. So this particular model is finished in a cirrus silver metallic. We have a new styling for the headlights, front grille, front cameras, um, really an incredible design. Under the hood is a four liter bi turbocharged V8 with an EcoBoost, 496 horsepower, 516 pound-feet of torque. All that power is directed to all four wheels via a nine-speed automatic transmission. You can see here 19-inch Aero 10 twin multi-spoke wheels. It's a nice wheel, black accent on the inside gives it a really sporty look. You'll see here the new door handle design sits flush with the vehicle when the car is locked. Classic Mercedes-Benz um, roof line and trunk line there. So you can see again, a very long stature, the S-Class being the largest in the Mercedes-Benz sedan lineup. A lot of design changes to the vehicle, especially as you get around to the rear, you'll see those um, new taillight design, gorgeous LED taillights, an intricate layout inside the taillight housing itself, S580 and 4MATIC badging. The 4MATIC is our all-wheel drive system, dual tip exhaust, rear parking sensors in the back and the front of the vehicle. Again, those taillights look absolutely incredible. It's a great design very modern, very sharp. It's a sleek car. It is a huge change from the previous model. You won't confuse this to an older model S-Class driving down the road. It is absolutely incredible. Now the design changes don't end with the exterior. The inside has gotten a complete overhaul. The next generation of Mercedes-Benz technology and of course the most uh, modern technologically advanced car you can get on the road. So let's take a closer look at the interior of the new 2021 Mercedes-Benz S-Class. Taking a look at the interior of the brand new Mercedes-Benz S580. We'll start with the door and move across the dashboard. You can see a whole new layout, a whole new design. Ambient lighting gets kind of a nice glow from an interior laid light strip inside that piece of trim. So you get the line and a nice kind of fade to it power, memory, seats, heated and ventilated seats. Um, here we can see our whole new dashboard. We have a 12.3 um, inch widescreen digital instrument cluster. We have a 12.8 inch OLED touchscreen central display. We'll show you controls of that more throughout the video. Absolutely gorgeous. And then moving along to the rear of the vehicle. You can see the S-Class, typical, lots of legroom, lots of space, more of that ambient lighting. You get a nice floating trim piece here with your door handle, lock, unlock, and then your seat controls, heated seats and ventilated seats for the rear passengers as well. We have rear uh, uh, shade control in the window so we can raise and lower our sunshades in the car very easily. And the nice thing is, is once they're down, they tuck very neatly right back into the top of the door trim. Looking into the rear seats, you see that nice wood trim across the rear seat, tons of leg room, huge Burmeister surround sound system speakers, more of that ambient lighting across the top of the door, middle and lower door panels. It's absolutely gorgeous. Let's take a closer look at the details um, at the front of the vehicle and the multimedia system. Inside the new S580, we can take a more closer detailed look at the interior. Um, starting with, as I mentioned, our door panels. The automatic lights have changed, so they now sit up top on the uh, top of the door panel. Heated ventilated seats. We have a new haptic feedback sensor for the seat control. So instead of moving the actual button, you kind of just press it and the seat moves. It's a nice, neat little option. Uh, mirror adjustment, window controls are pretty much the same. Your rear sunshade control is actually down here on the center. Um, now a really neat feature, when your blind spot monitoring is blinking as a vehicle in your blind spot, your ambient lighting here in the vehicle, which you can see right now is blue, will turn red. It just makes it more noticeable. It's a really nice feature. Steering wheel control, similar to what we've seen on the Mercedes-Benz E-Class in 2021. We have cruise control functions on the left, 
voice, volume, phone control functions on the right, a beautifully wrapped wood steering wheel, that 360 wood feel, the seamless edges. It's really, really nice. New knob styles here. So we get a nice metal machine finish on our wipers, our gear selectors, our paddle shifters, and this 12 inch display up front is absolutely amazing. There's a 3D screen effect you can add to this display. So it creates a very 3D kind of depth feel to it. There's really not a good way to explain it until you see it in person, but you feel like you can reach into the display itself. It's incredible. Um, I have not seen that before in a vehicle. Um, heads up display, an absolutely massive heads up display unit, completely customizable. You can have eco displays, you can have standard uh, speed limits, sport modes. This also includes augmented reality. So you can display all of your navigation details. This will overlay directional arrows for your navigation in the heads up display on the road ahead of you. It is 100% ahead of its time in terms of technology and use. Now, moving across the vehicle, you can see nicely inlaid air vents up top. We can adjust how the air is put through by these little buttons. Engine start stop button, pretty much right where you'd expect to see it. And we have a new 12.8 inch OLED multimedia display. This is a brand new system for Mercedes Benz. Another change too we'll see is the key. This is the new key for the S Class. It's a unique design, looks kind of like a spaceship, but it's a neat, neat item. Um, so looking at our center console and screen, we have a very nice gloss black center console, easy to open and close, two cup holders, storage, wireless charging, USB-C ports, and up top here we have our very nice frameless rear view mirror. Um, we have a beautiful design. You can see this speaker system. You can see the edges around that top display. This is all of our sunroof control. It's a really, really nice feature. Take a closer look here at our center multimedia control. This is a, uh, a reconfigured MBUX system. So your navigation, phone, radio, media, anyone who's in, been in a 2019 or 2020 Mercedes, this part will look familiar, but a lot has changed. You can see navigation now has a new menu, easy to pinch and zoom. This screen is absolutely incredible, easy to type in directions. Your home button brings you right back. Phone control, radio control, click the radio, pulls up your full radio menu right here. Um, home button brings you back. Phone control, same thing. Uh, climate control, is right here. So your climate menu comes up. You can see our climate controls off right now, but here's your left and right side, uh, multimedia, comfort, ambient lighting. So you can see massaging seat controls right here, seat adjustments, ambient lighting adjustments. So we can go through and change the ambient light display in the vehicle. So now you can see a nice pink change over to red, go into yellow and white, move over into green, and then back towards blue. It's a really, really nice system. We click in the multicolor, we can get a couple different options. This is called Malibu Sunset. Now you can see, if you look in the door, the light actually changes. We get a nice pink going over to a purple, and if you take a look at the passenger door, we get a pink fading into a yellow. This is a really cool, very new, a piece of technology from Mercedes-Benz. Um, we can change into a red moon, which gives us a bunch of different displays. This is a really, really nice feature. Little things that make it feel special. Um, it's an absolutely gorgeous car. There are many more options, many more features to discuss. If you have any questions, we're happy to answer them for you. 207-510-2253 is my direct extension. S row, that's S R O E at driveprime.com is my email. Once, as I said, my name is Spencer. Um, if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out. Again, our dealership is Prime Motor Cars Mercedes Benz. We're located at 137 US Route 1 in Scarborough, Maine. If you are not local to our dealership, that is not a problem at all. We work with clients all over the country, so arranging transport, um, overnighting paperwork doing everything we can, personal video tours of the vehicle you're buying, everything we can to make the buying process as easy as possible. 
and uh, you can purchase the vehicle without even leaving your home, have it delivered directly to your driveway. Thank you so much for watching the review of the new 2021 Mercedes-Benz S-Class. Um, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed.